another day, another postcard in hashtag July postcard play from Carrie Griffiths. I am using my new die cut machine. I was playing with the die cuts and with the embossing folders that now I own. <laughs> and uh, from all the things I thought about this window. Um, I took a uh, jelly printing paper, I did, and uh, it's a little bit difficult to take it out from the die, but I did it. A little bit of toothpick. Sorry about my dogs, if you can hear them. I cannot shut them up as I did with the fan. <laughs> yes, you don't hear the fan today. The sacrifice I do for this video. <laughs> okay, I have my windows cut. Now I need to fold them because they are like they are open. I am going to play more with that in another occasion. I think I'm going to do some, uh, not clear one, uh, acetate, but I have one that it's translucent, or I can do my, my papers, my translucent papers too. But right now, let's take the vase <laughs> out of my box and my holder. And let's do something with that window. I tried this side and it was okay, but when I finally chose the, chose the, the the ephemera, what I am going to put there, I thought it's better on the dark side because it's a, it's the moon. The moon is in a dark environment. So I have my cats, my curious cats. I have my moon and I'm going to put them on the other side, of course. <laughs> Sometimes it's so difficult to take decisions. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am there. Several minutes talking to myself. <laughs> and then I decide to cut first round and at the end I fussy cut it. Not completely like you will see. It turned out very good. That's it. I thought about putting in a black uh, car stock and then I say I have I have on the other side the grungiest, darkest print. Why don't you use that? That is when I decide to cut the moon more. So it's not a fuzzy, fuzzy cut because I wanted some of the background, but at least have the same form as the moon. Okay, I'm loving this. Let's start to glue things, please, Miriam. I think one of the cat's um, tail, it's uh, out, so I need to cut it. 
but I'm going to wait till the end. Of course, I'm going to leave the tail up without gluing so I can cut it and then glue. Uh, all the time you need to be to to look at your placement with everything. It's not uh, worth it if you glue it and then it's out of the window. You see, now I am cutting the tail so it will fit inside. <laughs> Those cats are something. <laughs> I want to do more of them. I had an idea then and I tried to start. I said to myself, better to glue now the window a little piece of the print that it's out. So now let's glue the window and see if I can put marker all around so it will be different in the inside and the outside. It's a make-believe, but you try to do it as best as you can. You see, there are not a lot of elements there. Three pieces of ephemera on a print, and that's it. You have a postcard. Of course, we need the numbers. We don't need to forget the numbers. And put the correct number, Miriam, this time, please. It's. Day 17, the 17th of July. I cannot believe it. I really cannot believe it. It's not so easy to put this uh, window. I think next time I will do some uh, double-sided tape on them, but uh, I managed to do it, anything. And, uh, yep, you will see it's uh, very pretty with all the metal around. I had a metal embossed aluminum and everything, and I didn't use it. I don't know why <laughs> I could use that. Next time. Next time I can emboss my car, my base. <laughs> That's a great idea. <laughs> I will try. And you will be my uh, oh, okay. You will be there. <laughs> Oh, I love it. And it's good because we can close it to put on the holder, but you can take out and open the windows, and that's uh, another view. Yeah, if, if I put something opaque on the windows, so you don't see and you need to open to see. That's another alternative. 
We will do more windows. Yes. I have an idea with an embossing folder on the base and then the car, the, the, the window. Oh, we can do so many things like that. Now I am going to do the backing. Yes, you see, I am really behind with those I am doing as I do the postcard. But it will be okay if I do some of them and put on my ephemera. I will. <laughs> I will because it takes a lot of time in, during the the video. Let's see. I'm putting my name now, July two thousand and twenty-four. That is the date, and of course, my signature you don't need to put the date on the day on the date because we have the day on the card every number that we put is the number of the day in july that we present the postcard and uh, if you need to know about this challenge, you can go to the description in this video or any one of the videos of the list. I have a playlist, July Postcard Play, and you can see the video, the launch video of the challenge by Kerry Griffith. It's a link. And you have a link also to PMRC Studio to Eddie Makes Art and to Darcy Disadventures, uh, Misadventures with Mixed Media, and to my own coffee too. So if you need some print tables or some jelly plates, jelly prints, sorry, to fulfill your challenge, you can is there. Okay, this is my card and I love it. Even clothes have some interest in because they don't close, close uh, enough. Now let's put the postcard with the other postcards. I am so, so glad I am participating. Thank you, Carrie, for doing that. And thank you for being here. Here is the postcard. Bye.